Too many, too many things are going to like co-run with me today. Our entire lab is here in this hotel today, right? This, and there's a large team which is supporting in the background. You can see a team sitting there, right there. Bunch of guys here and we are completely suited. So are we saying there are like tons of users on the virtual world? The answer is no. But there are tens and millions of people who are there in the gaming worlds right now. In this particular session, the thing to note is 5G is going to be a game changer for marketers. So we are running a series of module on marketing in the 5G era. Last week exactly at this venue, I was running a session on drone marketing. And uh, Taj, these guys never allowed me to float a drone. They took away my battery. Today, we don't need drones, but we are completely suited deep within. So we are going to control whatever I do, my metahuman does. And, and guess what? Once I create my metahuman, I don't need to be there. Somebody else can come and control my metahuman and record content out there. That makes it very powerful. Imagine top celebrities in India today, if you render their character, and if you get them, get someone else, like you use body double. Gone are the days when Salman Khan used to come up with a movie, Jurwa, and people used to get shocked saying that, how are these both? We've real life, mein hi dekha hai, right? Now look at this. Everyone would have their own digital twin, who would then multitask and do a lot of work. What is making this possible? So all the tech stack, which are there as part of our R&D lab, they are going to get life because of 5G. When we did our first campaign using mocap, which is Group M, Essence Mediacom, along with uh, IIC, Disney, there was a large team that worked on it. And last year, in one of the panels, I was talking about how it was a, like a funny context, but I, I meant it when I threw that use case, saying that if it's a cricket board meeting and Virat couldn't make it, and there goes Virat, he'll pop in there, and there'll be conversations which are going to be running. We actually made that possible by getting fans from various locations in India, they popped into a live studio environment, and that's how the fan meet was being done, right? How was that made possible? That is 5G for you. So 5G is not for video, but it's going to enable so many such things, which are getting suppressed because of bandwidth, are going to get invoked and are going to get life in the 5G era. And that's what you're seeing. The entire infrastructure is getting geared for it. Have you ever seen a VR device priced at 1300 rupees? Have you? No, right? And there are tons of people who watched IPL cricket in immersive form using a VR device which is Geodai for 1300 rupees. That is almost like democratizing a hardware which is going to go places. And this is all part of the XR strategy with a lot of big brands and telecom operators are driving. We'll come into picture. There are, there are going to be 3D destinations where they would visit. There are going to be avatars like this which they would control. And that's going to do show and tell in various pockets out there, right? So are you with me? on 5G and mocap and metahuman, which is today's topic, and how we leverage it for one of the brands. And today, we also have one of my ex-colleagues, Digda, with me. She is a co-founder of this super-duper bright startup, which helped us release this campaign on uh, Airtel. Uh, Stigda is actually was with us, and she had a very interesting story in terms of how it all started, and where is she today, helping us, collaborating, and we are doing a lot of work together yeah. in this sci-fi era of XR, as we call it. Tigna, over to you. Thank you, Neeraj. That was quite an entry. And my avatar, I've just left it for workshops with the client back at office. So I hope she's doing an amazing job. Um, thank you all for being here. Um, it's truly exciting to be on the stage and to be uh, talking about metahumans and digital twins and alter egos. It's, um, it's a truly amazing journey that we are embarking right now. Um, before we deep dive into the used cases and what all we can do for the brands and leverage it and um, all of those things, I would just like to introduce myself a little bit. So I'm Snigda, I'm co-founder at IIC. I handle the strategy side of things. Um, my journey with strategy started long back um, when I was in NIFT in Bachelors and I got placed um, with top retail brands in India, Shopper Store, Being Human, Future Group. I soon realized that retail was not just one segment that I wanted to cater to and I wanted to cater to automobiles, I wanted to cater to BFSI, FMCG brands and all of those things and I knew if I had to continue my dream and journey of catering multiple brands together. Um, the only way was uh, being a part of an agency and I joined WPP. So yeah, I'm a product of WPP. Um, we used to handle a lot of amazing clients at Fitch, um, which is now Landor and Fitch. Um, we used to cater Domino's, we used to cater Wix. We had very fun times during that time and I learned a lot. Cut to today, now um, 
me and Manish basically are uh, running IIC. I learned the things that I've experienced, the things that I've learned, I'm trying to apply it here. Um, IIC basically, I would not go through the entire startup struggle journey. That's for another session. Um, IIC basically is all things MarTech. And we in essentially humanize technology through design, creating very impactful and immersive solutions. Um, as of now, the focus and the sizzling thing that we are doing is integrating 5G, XR, and AI into online interactions and offline activations. That is the core as of now. Parallelly, we are doing and working in a lot of technologies as well, one of them being MetaHuman, digital twinnings, and all of those things. So without further ado, I'll how ask is, Manish. How is, all, how is it all evolving? Like There was an interesting example you were showing me of Keanu Reeves and how accurate the render is. Keanu Reeves, so, yeah. Let's have a look at that. Yeah, yeah. Maybe. Let's do. Now Looking let's load it. What we are and the choices we make, the worlds we build. For and instance, I'm not even sure questions. why I'm here. About why we want I remember to choose waking up this, and thinking that, that I'm supposed to come here. Why we want to make X that it was instead of Y. To ask where do ideas of how, how do we, we know are and what, what we is want real even come from? In an industry I, where actors have tried to remain perpetually young. Over 20 years ago, we I first played the character face. Thomas Anderson in the Matrix trilogy. Hi, I'm Carrie Ann Moss, and I played Trinity in the Matrix films. 20 years ago, we asked ourselves how long just, it would be before they, faces they, they and bodies could be changed as easily as we change clothes. We wondered, what would identity mean in a completely digital world? And what would reality mean when a world we can build feels as real as our own? Every time, every time uh, we show this uh, AV to our marketers, they say this is too English. This must be all happening in Bollywood. What's the state of art when it comes to India, right? So let me just take you to our lab and show you our Indian prototype that how realistic is CGI is, right? Yeah. Let's just play that AV, please. Let's come to India. This is India. We are building India. Extremely photorealistic. Alright, how was that? This is India. Let's just stop it. How was that, guys? <laughs> I need a big clap for this one, yeah? This is our output. <laughs> India is doing it. Please. Yeah. So now, in the 5G era, more and more characters are going to go photorealistic. Let me invite Manish. Manish and me pretty much are geared with similar kind of a costume. But before that, we want to show you an AR experience, for which I'll have to come here, because we've done some level of mapping. And this is something I wanted to do it with uh, my very, very amazing super maverick client, Mr. Amit Doshi from Britannia. Britannia CMO, he completely loves this space. So I thought I will just create a quick render for him. And please record this. I want to send it to him over WhatsApp. All right, look at this. Tap. There you go. That's an augmented reality, which is getting overlaid on top of a mocap powered Meta-human, it can be a brand character for all you know, right? Now look at use cases for marketers. All of us in the room, we do a lot of mall activations. Can we get our the face of the brand or brand ambassadors to pop into retail locations? Me and Prashant, we were having a conversation about how can we drive conversations with Gen Z outside the Burger King outlets, right? Can we have a multiplayer gaming where your lead pro protagonist is in the in studio environment? You don't even need him. All you need to just render is metahuman, and someone like us is sitting inside that mocap gear which I'm wearing, which is completely loaded with sensors out here. And then you can control an experience. You can get them to play a game, for all you know. And that is what we intend to do right now. Me and Manish will show you a quick game, and then Manish will do the talking of how he creates all this magical <laughs> stuff. Let's go for it. Come on, guys. Game time. Well, TK, I'm loaded up. Neeraj, in three, two, one, shoot. Okay, sorry, my aim was really bad. One sec, three, two, one, I'll down, burst shoot. Okay, in three, two, one, burst. 
बस 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 एंड बस ऑडियंस इज एज वेल इट्स बर्गर्स बर्स्टिंग मी प्रशांत यू वांट टू प्ले विथ अस कम ओवर लेट्स यू जस्ट नीड टू डॉच दिस मनीष एंड प्रशांत कम ऑन गाइस प्रशांत बर्गर किंग ओके देन आई थिंक वी शुड टेक अ स्टेप बैक प्रशांत लेट बी इन सेंटर आर यू गाइस बोथ गोना हिट थैंक यू यस थैंक यू सो मच फॉर डूइंग प्लीज Yeah, okay. and you are watching this, and okay. there are burgers so, coming to you. Okay, so I will. You have to just dodge. In... I don't know about that. I'm going to do a bad job. <laughs> okay, but so it's still fine. It's still fine. Okay, okay, so it's a three, two, one, budge, budge here. Okay, three, two, one, once more. Oh. Three, two, one, once more. One sec. Hey, <laughs> no, so I can I can bring it down. This is real time physics. Okay, sorry. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Okay, you are going now. Maybe I'll just come and. All right, we got it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Prashant. We are coming to you now with the prototype since we worked so hard. Come on, guys! This team has really worked so hard. We haven't slept. Have you? Do you see an event like this where the team puts up so much efforts? Right? This is seriously crazy. If we would have have to do it, we could have done it in the mall actually with some celebrity. But the what we are trying to do here is to create an experience which exists in India. it's independently can be deployed in india we have everything available what you are seeing is not some ppt which you clients usually see saying that hum ye kar denge this is india this is why we are collaborating with startup players using our creative thinking and deploying these kind of solutions right so we need to get into the, the into the drawing board and start thinking solutions for the 5g era that is what we call it marketing in the 5g era which is not just to watch videos but experiences consumer cx which you can never ever forget that's what we are trying to create here right are you with me all intense looks kisi ko kuch samajh mein nahi aaya but yeah you are loving the feeling right so this is what we can do for you over to you manish uh well neeraj thanks a lot uh, and thanks for having me here i was not quite feeling in my skin today so i just became a cyborg now as you rightly said that i didn't have to be here i could have joined anywhere in the world in any shape or form and this reminds me of a very recent case study of airtel and disney star so we did 10 broadcasts with them very recently and i would like to just bring up one clip where what we were doing we were bringing different fans from different parts of india and they were interacting with yes this is the last one okay they Let's were interacting with uh, celebrities in sasport studio and this happened in just recent ipl so can we play the clip of uh, ahana It's the last one. Whoa! I really hope we win this year. But uh, Team RCB, win or lose, we are with you. Who are those two players who have their face on the screen? And your time starts now. Well okay the first one is my favorite Virat Kohli um I can't guess the other one Oh is it our captain uh, Pab Du Plessis Yes yeah. Pab Du Plessis and Virat Kohli Ana tumne prove kar diya yahan pe yes you are the ultimate fan we are sending you back home as fast as we can All right thank you so much guys